I got a question for you. When was the last time you did something just for the fun of it? You know, we have such busy schedules and we book things and we put them into our calendar, but we forget to put things on there just for the fun of it. Think about it. How would you feel if you set aside seven to 10 days to visit an island? That you get off the grid and into the groove of some landmark fun on a beautiful island in the middle of the Caribbean. You look at your calendar and there you see it's blocked off. I'm going somewhere just for the fun of it. Puerto Rico is a U.S. territory and there's no passport required for U.S. citizens. No money exchange and like it or not your cell phone will work with no international charges on there. We put together group travel and a great selection of independent activities that nurture your soul. Here's a little overview of what I promise. I promise a unique evening on the town with dancing complete with one of the premier Latin dance instructors on the island. You'll have fun laughing with new friends and enjoying some good food. One day we will go to El Yunque, which is a rainforest as part of the U.S. Forest Service for a hike and swimming in the beautiful waterfalls of this luscious rainforest. There will be time for relaxing on the beach or learning to surf if you want. We pride ourselves for the abundance of activities and tours we offer. You choose what we want and we do the rest for you. We offer a, a time that you can pilot your own small boat to a small island just off the coast. And we'll savor a lunch on a secluded beach. You'll have time to snorkel in the crystal clear ocean. That's just one of the trips that we offer during the time that we're in Puerto Rico. If you're up for a little high-flying fun adventure, you'll have the opportunity to ride one of the longest zip lines in the world, stretching 4,700 feet above the forest, 800 feet in the air. And if that's the fun you're looking for, you also can rappel down 230 feet into the rainforest. How would you like to hop aboard a 55-foot power catamaran and visit the island of Culebra and one of the top beaches in the world, Flamenco Beach. We'll enjoy lunch on the boat. All your rum drinks are included. This is one of the 12 different tours and adventures we offer. You just choose one and we will make sure that you have fun. Say, how about this? Around eight o'clock one evening, you and a partner will guide your kayak through mango trees to a unique bioluminous bay one of only five in the world. And you'll watch these microorganisms glow around the boat. It's an adventure of a lifetime. But kayaking isn't for you. You can also ride a power motorboat into the bay and enjoy the experience. That's just one of the other adventures that you can do just for the fun of it. If shopping makes you smile, wait until you see the great prices and the selections in one or more of the hundred local and national stores in Old San Juan. Old San Juan is the oldest city on U.S. soil and the second place that Christopher Columbus landed. Well, we'll continue that time in Old San Juan with a cultural tour of the old cities and the stone forts that's protected it for centuries. You know, that experience there may give you a little deja vu experience because movies like Pirates of the Caribbean have been filmed there all around Old San Juan. Are you a scuba diver or a wannabe scuba diver or perhaps just a lover of snorkeling? Well, Puerto Rico offers many sites with beautiful underwater nature and fish and coral. There's so much to do on the island that we offer for you. So this gives you a, a little bit of the idea of what we have to offer, but let me tell you about a couple other things that you can do on the island. You can explore a thousand year old caves or visit one of the world's largest radio telescopes. You might remember it from the movie Contact with Jodie Foster. There's a mountain coffee plantations and a hot springs thought to be the fountain of youth by Ponce de Leon. And last but not least, a 90 minute ride to the Caribbean side of the island for a laid back day enjoying the hospitality of a family owned vineyard. Sampling some local wines on the deck overlooking beautiful Bahia Nostra Bay. For a little island there's much to experience. So again I ask you, 
What would it feel like? You flip open that calendar and there it is, Enchanted Island Travels. We offer real, fun travel. So join me and some of my local friends on the island in the Caribbean just for the fun of it. Wait, I almost forgot something. If you want to extend your trip a few days, you can jump on a ferry and go over to what's called the Spanish Virgin Islands that are part of Puerto Rico and enjoy more time in the sun. Or you can take a short flight to St. Thomas or St. Croix or St. John. All of these are part of the U.S. Virgin Islands. And from any of those islands, there's a ferry to carry you to one of the other islands. Or if you do have a passport and you want to go to the British Virgin Islands, there's a beautiful island of Tortula for world-class dining, sightseeing, snorkeling, and diving. Well, all in all, we help you personally design a trip of a lifetime. And as I've said before, we're going to do this just for the fun of it.